Guys, you'll have seen a lot many aspects of the farm business that we do. The farming, the processing, our marketing and everything and you'll have been, you know, associated with us. But we have not shown you all one of the most important aspects that ensure that we give you the best quality always and that you keep trusting us not only basis of word but a basis of a lot of scientific stuff and that is our laboratory it's an in-house laboratory that we have created and we have an amazing setup and an amazing team let me show you inside So guys, this is the laboratory. It has more or less all the equipment we need for testing all the raw material, all the finished goods, all the complaints that you give us. We get those products back and get it tested out here. We have an amazing team of scientists and food technicians. Let me hand it over to Vishruti because after all, I'm a farmer. She's a real scientist. She's a master in food technology and heads the entire quality department. So hi, Vishruti. Hello. Uh, let us take our uh, customers and our uh, people who have been following us through what the laboratory is for and what kind of machinery is there. Can you just take us through the laboratory? Yeah. So we will start from here. This is the titration assembly. By testing this, we are ensuring that whatever we are making, whatever we are producing are good in their quality. Then uh, we have this butyrometer. Okay. So by Prisma technology, by using the light, we can just put a drop of oil or fat here in this instrument within a fraction of second it will give us a reading okay and here the graph is where we can decide that by this reading by this reading whether our oil is adulterated or not with some another oil so oh, we are nice. ensuring the quality by so checking do you this do this every this. day every day every single batch for the finished products yes for the finished products okay here we have a moisture analyzer moisture is the very important factor for every dry products we are checking the moisture because moisture plays essential role to have a stability and to have a st good shelf life with the product so guys you all know the kind of farming we do but uh, since now the brand is growing there are many people who want to try out and who are trusting us we don't stop you know with only telling you all that we do it organically and showing you the farm at the back end but we would like to put our products through the most rigorous test to ensure that you know are we missing something at the back end you know and to get those reading types so i think the test is uh, it's in process till the time this happens i think vishruti can take us through yeah. what's out here so these are the process goods for these uh, this week okay so batches are in preparation by the time we will finish the entire analysis of these batches and once the analysis will be finished we will release the batches to the customers so this is like when the product is made, you're taking controlled, controlled samples, samples and you're testing it for all the parameters test of procedures and yeah. parameters you have. Yeah. And once you approve it, then it goes for production, production. of a packaging. Packaging, you know. That's nice. This is Soxlet assembly. So all the products like oils, uh, ghee, laddus, we have a fat content in those products. Okay. So fat analyzer. This is a Soxlet apparatus and fat measures here. Oh wow. Okay. That's nice. Yeah. Uh, this is hot air oven. In hot air oven with the domestic method, we check the moisture content of our semi-solid and liquid products. So I think we have put the kapli gluten and gluten. the regular market out of gluten for a oven now. Oven now, yeah. yes. And this is muffle furnace. This is very interesting instrument. The, see, the temperature is 555 degrees Celsius. This we use to check the ash content of the product. Ash content means if we are detecting ash more than certain percentage prescribed by FSSI, that means our product has inorganic matter in it, like heavy metals, like pesticides, like soil residues. You know, before kind of ending this, um, how big is your team? How big is our quality team now? Uh, now, my team size is of 12. 12 people. Yeah. And uh, what are your plans uh, for the new laboratory? And, you know, how strong do you want to make this team? And what all infrastructure you want to put in additional in the coming year's time? 
yeah so as you know we are coming up with the two more labs so i would be requiring more 10 scientists so you will see another 10 people added to the team in the yes. next one year's time yes and two additional laboratories two additional laboratories so i think guys this is a roundup of uh, the scientific testing and our laboratories we are happy to show you all all this infrastructure when you all whenever you all visit the farm and the mega kitchen